I'm Stacy. I'm John. And this is Raw Ability Life. Life. Good Thursday morning. Oh my god, you remember what day it was? I, I know, it's amazing, isn't it? I actually remembered on my own what morning it was. <coughs> I am not feeling too bright this morning, but it is a little self inflicted. How many of you guys were play started playing the um, Hogwarts mystery last night? How many of you worked out it takes an hour and 40 minutes to refill your whole energy bar? And then how many of you woke up every hour and 40 minutes to start playing and clicking away at it again? Or is it just this lunatic here? Probably just this lunatic here. Anyhow, that's why I'm feeling rough this morning. Had to use my lab this morning because, yeah, it was really, really rough. And my inhalers just weren't cutting it. And then I went back to sleep for a little bit. Although, only for a little bit, you know, that hour and 40 minutes before I had to start tapping away again. <laughs> Oh dear. Uh, I am editing the vlog from yesterday right now. And I've got Harry Potter on the TV to watch, playing my Harry Potter game. So I'm kind of having another Harry Potter day, chilling out while John's at work. And then we're going to sit down with the camera and catch you all up with a load of things that I've been need catching up on. Like the parking ticket stuff and the parking issue for the carers. But I need to just chill today. Um, and tomorrow we're going to chill too because then John's off work and then that's when we start getting a bit more active. So these three days are my chill days. But as you can see, I... Oh, hands in the way. As you can see, I am editing yesterday's vlog, which is blatantly Harry Potter themed. And on the TV I have... Harry Potter, except I haven't pressed play yet, but when I press play, I am going to start from the first movie and work my way through. So, I will catch you guys, so I will catch you guys later, but in the meantime, if you have not seen it already, check out the unboxing for my Harry Potter World of Wizardry. Link should be up there, and I will catch you later. Good Thursday. Um, today has just been. You all right? No, I'm just double checking. <laughs> <coughs> He's double checking his recording. He doesn't trust himself. Today has just been a really chill out, relaxing day. I have spent time checking around social media, replying to messages here, there, and everywhere, dealing with emails and paperwork. So I really have not been vlogging as I've gone along today because I needed to concentrate on all of that because it's part of prepping for going on my holiday. Don't want to be doing paperwork or any of that while I'm on holiday. But I wanted to take the moment now just to catch you up on a few things. So obviously over the last few weeks we've had a few things that I've been dealing with. Uh, my PIP, uh, my exchange from DLA to PIP. So far I've had absolutely nothing, I don't know where I stand with that still. I would have liked to have had some communication to tell me that what's going on, whether there's been nothing. I've had absolutely nothing. So I don't know whether I'm having an assessment, face-to-face -face assessment, or whether I'm going for a clear changeover, or what's going on yet. <coughs> so that's where I am with the PIP. I have no clue. Um... The solicitors regarding the parking issue at my mine, I have heard from the lawyer and it's 
bit confusing because the care agency bless the hearts they tried to help they contacted the actual car parking company who um, tried to make an agreement with them that they could the carers could call the car parking company that the people who issued the tickets and they would give temporary free day tickets however when one carer tried to do this it took 15 minutes out of my call to do that when I have a half an hour call at the and at one time during three days a week that took half of my call and it's a time sensitive call it's not a good good thing had I told the care the lawyer this and originally our plan was to go after the people who employ the car parking people the people who took away the process who we had a uh, uh, something in place that was working and they've taken that away and they haven't made another reasonable adjustment to make it possible for me to still receive my care safely so I need to re-clarify with the lawyer that I think he's not quite understanding who I want to go over, go after and why. Um, I received a second email from him today because I didn't get around to replying to the first one because I got it like the day before I fell out my chair. Uh, regards to falling out my chair and the botanical gardens, I had hoped I didn't have to deal with that. Um, found out from Kirsty, the carer that took me today, she took another client there today and apparently it's still not signed. There is no sign, there is nothing barriering it off and I mean she said well you know it's only, they have had the weekend, no they've had more than the weekend, it's uh, nearly a week since the incident now. Um, so for me that is not acceptable so I now will be making a formal complaint to them. Um, Toby Carvery, the issues there were very low on my list to deal with but something I was going to deal with however I know Abby is taking that off my hands and I so appreciate that Abby, I cannot tell you how much I appreciate that. I am dealing with so many other things that I'm not the sort of person I know if I don't speak up other people are going to be harmed by it so I try and deal with as many issues as I can and make people aware of what is not okay but sometimes it does get too much so you have to learn which battles to fight and which battles not to fight so that's where I am with those battles now I may have forgotten some and if I have put it put it down there now over the next couple of weeks especially over the weekends and Mondays and Tuesdays we are going to be starting to pack to go away and one thing I would like to do as you all, got, all know is the day before we travel we will not vlog we I will probably do a pre-recorded something but we will not vlog on that day so that I can rest and John can rest ready for the traveling day what we have also decided to do while we're on holiday, we are going to record every day we're away, but we're not going to waste our holiday time editing those vlogs and getting them up, just like we did in our last holiday when we were at home, because it does take me three, four, sometimes five hours to edit those vlogs, uh, vlogs sorry, especially the big ones, like holiday ones, where it's so much to put in it. I will do it when I get home. However, what me and John came up with an idea so that we could still keep in touch with you is we thought it would be super cool what we could do is we're going to do a live um, video link through YouTube every day at, at the moment we're planning 6pm however when we get there we might find that actually the be it's a better time to do it at a different time. Um, because obviously we don't know what time the live entertainment is so what I might do is ring Vartlins and try and get an idea of what time would be better um, because obviously I'm saying 6pm because that's not time we'd normally put our vlogs up so we will work that out hopefully before we get there the live vlog the live vlogs are just going to be very quick update you with what we how things are going um, and then you'll get your proper vlogs when get when we get home so you're not going a whole five six seven days without us um, don't want any of you getting withdrawal symptoms I don't want to get withdrawal symptoms from you guys you know one thing I would really really like to do and this would actually help me 
uh, make a cool video for you guys for the one I put up on the day before we travel, the one I could pre-record and that is a Q&A regarding travelling with a disability um, uh, let's say disability slash chronic health conditions because they all come under one bridge I want, I'm going to cover some things obviously over my videos um, and I'm going to forget other things so I'm going to put up a post when I put up this video uh, it, um, when I, I'll put it up on Facebook. I'll put up a post asking you for your questions, your your questions regarding um, traveling, so that I can try. Me and John can try and answer your questions, and where possible, physically show you some solutions um, in helping you to pack, travel, whatever. Anything regarding traveling for holidays, um, for anything. Let, let, let's get some of those questions answered. Where we can, we will answer them. Where we don't know the answers, we'll try and find the answers for you. We will do the best we can. But you can help us by giving us those questions. So if you go over to Facebook, you'll find I'll put up a post asking for your questions. Write your questions on, on there. And don't feel you only have to ask one question. You can write as many questions as you like, as long as they're not rude. <laughs> yes, honey. We have 31 subscribers. Since when? Since right now. I just looked at it. We have 31 subscribers. Wow, our subscribers went up very, very quickly. Ah, oh, scary. So, guys, also, don't forget, we're now even closer to get doing our 100 subscriber giveaway. Those of you who don't realize, one of my vlogs shows what we're giving away. I have a box that I have made. I'm not going to show you tonight. I will show you it at future. I have a box I have made and I am slowly putting lots of really cool stuff in it. Everywhere we go, we're picking things up, we're putting them in there. When we get to 100 subscribers, I'm going to do something to give that away. I just wanted to update you today. Tomorrow I will vlog like normal. But today I needed to get all that paperwork done. I needed to do the emails. I needed to start co getting those complaints out. And tomorrow I'm going to continue that. But I'm not so busy. So I will be doing my normal vlog. But please do help me and John to help you guys. By getting your questions to us regarding traveling with a disability or with chronic illness. We want to hear your questions. And we want to help answer your questions. And yes, I'm sorry it is a really short vlog today, but I kept gotta learn to say vlog, not vlog, vlog, not vlog. Um, so yeah, I'm in a crazy mood, can you tell? She's overtired. I am very, very overtired. So guys, I am going to catch you all tomorrow. Are you gonna come and say hello quickly? Hi. <laughs> and I got to cut his hair at the weekend too. Look, he's starting to become like a clown. It's sticking out. It's it's too. It's not long enough to turn, go down, so it's sticking out. So that's another thing on my to do list. Cut your hair. Yeah. So we will see you tomorrow. Thank, Thank you, you for joining, joining us in our crazy world. world. Bye. Oh, Q Misty. Yes, Q Misty. We actually got him today. Well, we didn't. The carrot did. <laughs>